Well, hello, folks. This is Bill, Bill Reddick Outdoors. I don't know about y'all, but sometimes I let my mouth get myself in a little bit of trouble. And I did a video sometime back about apparently they don't want my money. It was talking about working on boat motors because I take my motor to the shop and I get tired of them giving me the run around. It sits out there for a month, two months, and they never even look at it. And so I get mad and I bring it home and I tear it apart and fix it myself. <laughs> well, I had a neighbor. <laughs> He brought me this little jewel right here and said, Mr. Bill, I can't get that thing to pump water in no shape, form, or fashion. Could you help me out? He said, I've replaced the water pump. That thing still won't pump water. Can't get it to pump water. He said, see what you can do with it. <laughs> I'm no boat motor mechanic. I do stuff out of necessity. <laughs> but I said, sure, I'll see what I can do. So I, I pulled it apart and checked everything he did and it, it looked fine to me, put it back in together, it's still not pumping water. And so I said, maybe I missed something. So I pulled it apart again and I said, well, while I got it apart, I'm just gonna go ahead and order a new replacement kit. And so I ordered that and put it in, everything looks good. I even hooked a drill motor to it and put it in a bucket and spun the drive shaft and that thing was spewing water up. I said, well, we got her now. I put that thing back together, I put it in a bucket of water, fired that baby up, and there still ain't no water coming out the telltale. I have replaced this water pump, and it still don't pump water. <laughs> and I have got myself in a bind. I don't know what to do, uh, but I guess if the water is pumping from the bottom up to the head, there's a problem from the head somewhere, so I guess we're gonna have to remove the pull the power head on this thing and see if we can figure out what's going on. If I can't find nothing in there, <laughs> he's, we just out of luck. <laughs> Folks, am I tired. This old chair feels pretty good. I just can't work like I used to. I get give out pretty quick. But I can't quit, I gotta keep trying. And I sure was glad my son-in-law Josh come by and helped me out a little bit today because <laughs> I sure could use the help and I sure could use the extra brain power too. He's pretty sharp. And we got to looking around and we found a couple of little pieces I guess it was of an old impeller. It broke off up in there in a little bitty port in that power head and dug them things out. And he put that thing back together for me and we stuck it in the bucket of water and yanked that rope a time or two and that baby fired up. So always remember, whether you at work or play, I hope you have a nice day. This is Bill Reddick Outdoors. See y'all.